I didn't get a video when we started off this morning, but I don't know where we're at. We're someplace out in the Nevada desert. You see there's snow on that mountain over there. On the high desert. High desert. It's it's looking dis different. You don't see any more uh, cactus or anything out there. And it's a little it's a little chilly outside even. Yeah, and, and we're dressed in shorts and stuff, you know. <laughs> oh, we didn't plan ahead very good. I think Sophie's a little tired. I made her a bed in the back seat, but she kind of goes back and forth. She's been back there a couple times. But it's been an okay trip so far. Yeah. I think we've been on the road a little over three hours. Progress. We we just like taking this route because uh, it's flat. It, it, it's a it's mostly flat, no big hills, and uh, it's just not too many other people out here. Here's a uh, jackpot. Thanks. Cactus Pete's. I bet you that's where they're staying. At. Yeah. Cactus Pete's, that's probably the biggest casino in town and uh, probably the only casino open in town. Probably the only one open. Arriving at destination on right. No, this isn't. Um, they have an RV park right over there. Looks pretty nice. But uh, seeing you're <laughs> pretty much through town once you get to here. This jackpot's not real big. So now we're going to be leaving Nevada and uh, going into Idaho. I think I forgot to tape our spot when we came in last night. But uh, <laughs> yeah, we were pretty tired after that long day. So we're getting ready to close the trader up and uh, get on the road again. Today we're gonna stop in uh, Pendleton, Oregon. But uh, it won't be a, as long of a day. We're only doing, I think, it's like 350 miles today. But, uh, yeah, getting ready to go. Well, we're in Oregon. Kind of out in the middle of no place, kind of. But I think we're about 100 miles from La Grande. This part of Oregon is just full of hills, up and down, up and down, but it is very pretty, you can see. So, yeah. Cruising along. Yep, everything's going good. We probably got two more hours today of driving, and then we'll be uh, stopping in Pendleton. up here is beautiful. We're down there. See the casino? That's my thing in the way. That's where we're going. Down there is a casino. That's where we're going. But first, we're going to get down Dead Men's Pass. Last time, once we got to the Switchbacks, I turned the camera off. I couldn't do it no more. We're going to see this time how long I can leave the camera on for. Not sure how long it takes to get down. I never timed it. So far, it looks pretty tame, right? You just wait. <laughs> it, gets, it, gets, it gets a little steeper and a little scarier further down here. It wouldn't be bad if we didn't have that big heavy trader behind us. But yeah. But look at that view. That is amazing.
suppose that's encouraging to see that one away trunk truck ramp right there, right? <laughs> okay, here's the first switchback. The second one. Oh, yeah, I uh, I forgot to tape our spot here. We're at the Wild Horse RV Park. It's a casino. It's right at the foot of uh, Dead Man's Pass. And uh, we stayed here for a couple days just to rest up. I don't know. And you, from down here, you can see um, you can see the pass. You, you probably can't see it, but right up there you can see those cars. You can see them coming up and down that pass all day long. But, uh, yeah, so we're packing up when we're on the way to the ocean today. We're going to stay there for two weeks. And uh, then we'll be home. Kind of is home at the ocean. But it's a pretty nice park. Everyone has their own little patch of grass. And if you want to go to the to the um, casino they got a shuttle bus that'll come pick you up but um, yeah I guess I better go help Mike hitch up the baby's ready to go 
She's got the easy job. She's just got to sit in the truck and wait for us. And looks like we're ready to go. So we'll be on the road for a few hours today. And we're off. <laughs>